nós temos um remédio para você acabar de vez com medo, a vergonha e a timidez de falar inglês. Então fica com a gente nesse vídeo que nós vamos te dar uma dica valiosa para você acabar de vez com todo esse mal. <música> Olá, bem-vindo a mais um vídeo do nosso canal e nesse vídeo de hoje nós separamos um segundo trecho da entrevista que nós fizemos com da live, né, que nós fizemos com Flávio Lambstein, da, ele é diretor financeiro da MC Cruz, MC Cruzeiros aqui no Brasil e ele deu uma dica valiosa de como a gente deve fazer, qual o comportamento, a atitude que nós devemos ter com o nosso inglês, principalmente no ambiente profissional. A primeira dica que eu vou dar, que é um spoiler desse vídeo, ele diz pra gente, don't be shy. Exatamente, don't be shy, não seja tímido. E a partir daí ele vai dar algumas dicas baseadas na, na experiência profissional e pessoal que ele teve no uso do inglês no ambiente profissional. Então vamos assistir esse vídeo e aproveitar as dicas que o Flávio Lambstein deu pra gente de como usar o inglês no ambiente profissional. Flavio, now, now bringing uh, our conversation now to, to your day-by-day -day professional English, um, how, do you, how do you think you develop your professional uh, uh, communication, for example? What's very important to, to consider when you use English you know, in your in day-by-day -day prof in, in the professional, professional life? life? First, don't be shy again. Again, don't be shy. Okay, uh, we are a Brazilian. Uh, mm -hmm. We are not native. Okay, uh, for me, Uh, I'm not. I'm not considered myself as fluently. I know very well to maintain a good communication. Okay, in a professional life, you don't don't be shy in the professional life. Uh, it's a, it's the key word because mm -hmm. everybody has the same problem around the world. Okay, mm -hmm. I have mm -hmm. a, a contact with Italian. That Italian has a prob the same problem uh, with the language English uh, in, in an English level. Okay, uh, because mm -hmm. imagine ah, uh, the guy live abroad and speak English very well. No, okay. uh, everybody has the problem in, in around the world, Paulo. Only okay. if you only England, only Americans is a native. Okay. Exactly, exactly. Mm -hmm. Don't be shy and. Uh, mm -hmm. Not yeah, because some, some, some issues the wrong they words. To, yeah, the people, as I said, don't be shy. The people are, are afraid of making mistakes. They say, I only speak English if I speak perfect English. No, you use English, English is international language, no? As you said, you, yes. people that, you know, use a second language, so it's all right. You know? Exactly. I, I think that, uh, I believe that Brazilian speak uh, speak english better than another another people around the world because we try to, to speak yes, yes, with a, a grammar uh, with gra without grammar oh, mistakes grammar. Ex exactly yes. and for and for the 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 accent for us is is in our favor i think that uh, when the, when we speak uh, Okay, sometimes I have uh, some Italian accent because I have uh, 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 Italian classes because I like to study English, mm -hmm. study Italian, as you know, I, I love to study languages. Mm -hmm. But sometimes I, I speak English with some Italian accent, but Brazilian people we speak very, very clear. This is a good, a good, uh, a good way mm -hmm. and we can count this in our favor. Exactly, exactly. No, no, exactly. Very, very, very good. And, and the... Uh, uh, Flavio, when, when you started to, to, to use English, you know, in your professional life, do you remember when did you start to feel more confident? What, what did you do to feel more confident? To, to more, English? frankly speaking, more confident when I start working uh, in MSC, Paulo, because, okay, mm -hmm. during my, my, my period, my, my year, the years that I, I worked in KPMG, I just mm -hmm. have an English contact with a report, a writing, just writing. Mm -hmm. But when I started working in MSC, I needed to maintain day by day communication uh, with our headquarters in Switzerland. And of course, the first, the second time is not easy, but again, don't be shy. You start speaking and the, the English start growing, growing, growing in a good way. I think that uh, uh, when I started to work here, Uh, mm -hmm. I, I, be, I believe that my, my, I improved uh, my English in a good way. Mm 